typically we can really run across the whole gamut of Polaroid cameras. Um, we'll get a close up, we'll get a Spectra, we'll get um, an SX70 box camera, um, we'll get a Hello Kitty camera. Nothing ever beats when you find that little gem in the box, and that's the SX70 original folding camera. Four element lens, SLR, it's very advanced for its time, and even today it's still a great little camera. The SX70 camera is really a feat of engineering. It's a delicate balance between mechanics and chemistry. Here's what's happening with instant photography. The pods which holds the developing paste, the bottom of the frame hits the rollers, the thin pressure of the rollers causes the top of the pod to break, which begins the spread of the paste between the top of the film and the negative. If the rollers are off the slightest of a micron, the chemistry will not spread even throughout the frame and your magic will be slightly askew. When Polaroid first introduced the folding and non-folding SX70 camera, they used these Teflon coated grippy rollers, which they later discovered loses their grip over time. Polaroid eventually redesigned these to what you see in every 600 and Spectra cameras, which are stainless steel textured rollers that are dual geared. Impossible changes all of our rollers over to the stainless steel models. You know, I think everyone at, in the camera department, everyone who works for Impossible, has to have a lot of love for these cameras. If you ever sat there with one of these things and started taking apart the years of dirt and grime and skin wearage, and you start thinking about like where has this camera been and what's it seen, and you really become a friend to the camera, and you want to kind of help it out and give it a new life. The beauty with instant photography. It's something that doesn't live on your photo stream, hard drive. You know, it's something that's in your hand, developing in front of you, right in front of your eyes. 